Former 90 Day Fiancé cast member Stephen Friend has revealed a shocking truth about his family during his latest 90 Day Diaries appearance with Olda. Stephen Friend is talking about his painful past involving his dad in the latest episode of 90 Day Diaries. Stephen used to spend most of his summers in Ocean City. Stephen was a player, but everything changed when he met Olda. Stephen was intrigued by Olda's accent. He liked how smart, funny, and smoking hot Olda was. Stephen knew Olda was only in the U.S. for the summer. But Olda and Stephen were both 20 and not really bothered about their futures. Stephen was not expecting Olda to get pregnant. Stephen had only spent a month and a half with Olda. Olda had to go back to Russia within a week. Stephen proposed to Olda and applied for a K-1 visa to get her to America. Once her visa was approved, Olda came to America with baby Alex. Stephen and Olda tied the knot in a courthouse ceremony on August 30, 2019. They lived with Stephen's grandmother for a few years in Maryland, but later moved to New York. Stephen and Olda separated in October 2020. Stephen and Olda ended up getting back together when Olda found out she was pregnant again with a baby girl. They decided to work on their relationship after finding out the big news. Stephen was a 20-year-old from Bowie, Maryland, on 90 Day Fiance Season 6. Stephen was working as a waiter at a restaurant. Stephen said it wasn't what he wanted to do. However, Stephen had not graduated from high school and it was the best he could have done at the time. Stephen joked that since he was young, his life was party after party after party. Stephen had been arrested a few times for doing graffiti. Stephen's mom kicked him out when he was 16. Since then, Stephen had been bouncing around between his friend's house and his grandmother's house. Stephen wanted to be a part of his baby's life because he wanted to be able to do all the things he always wanted to do with his own dad. In season six, Stephen revealed his dad had died when Stephen was just seven, from type 2 diabetes. It was a hard time for Stephen, and he didn't want his kid to grow up without a dad. With having two kids, Stephen started thinking about his past, such as his not knowing the truth about his family. Stephen revealed that when he was 16 years old and doing something in the kitchen, his sister walked in. Stephen's sister was crying because their uncle had slipped out of his mouth that Stephen wasn't his father's biological child, but he wanted to take him in and raise him. Stephen revealed how heartbreaking it was for him to find out the person who was everything to him may not be his biological father. Stephen's mom couldn't remember much apart from a last name that sounded Irish. Stephen's relationship with his mother was very, very complicated. He thought that now, since he was older, he needed to have the answers himself. Stephen tried to get a DNA test kit. Olga commented on how she started seeing a change in Stephen since he started doing self-work. Stephen was becoming a better husband and dad. Stephen's test results came two months later and revealed who his ancestors were and where he came from. The report revealed Stephen was Northwestern European, 80% and 44.2% British and Irish. Stephen had looked up the surname that his mom had told him online, and it was an Irish name. Stephen saw the last name on the list of relatives and discovered a person who was his second cousin. Stephen's dad's name was not on the list, but there were some other relatives he could reach out to. Stephen had thought that the results would give him a clearer picture, but he needed more time to sit with it. Stephen said he would keep trying to find out who his real father was. As the 90 Day Diaries episode ended, little Alex asked Stephen, where's your dad? And Stephen replied, I don't know, I guess somewhere in Ireland. 